Hey y'all, welcome back to another grocery haul and meal plan video. We just got back from Kroger and we went with no list and no meal planned in mind. Um, so before coupons um, and Kroger deals this week, it was two thirty eight and change. And after deals and coupons, what we paid for it was one hundred and sixty four thirty seven. So we did really good. We saved almost. $74. So that was really, really good. So here is what we got. So I'll start over here. Um, so this is the stuff that I'm going to put up in my pan our pantry stock up. If you do not know what I'm talking about, um, I'll have that video linked in the description box below. So y'all can go and check out that. Um, I have made a whole video on that. I've got um, Google Docs that I created um, for like a $5 stock up plan that you can go buy. Um, and each week you spend $5 um, on an item and you put it up for your family so it's really easy of course you can spend more which is kind of what we did this week um i just got two extra things um but doing it five dollars at a time doesn't break the bank but you're able to stock up and have extra food in your uh, house for your family in case something happens so these were on sale for a dollar a piece this week so i picked up five for me to put back in the pantry um in the stock up and then i have two for me to have in the regular pantry so i got those i got three of the tomato basil two marinara and two of these um, six cheese and then I also got these to throw in the stock up pantry as well. I got one of the chicken bouillon and then one of the beef bouillon. These are just good to have on hand. And this is a good shelf stable um, item. So I picked those up to go back there as well. And then up here, we'll start in the back. We picked up three Red Baron pizzas. These were on sale for three for $10. So we got one pepperoni and two cheese. We really like the Red Baron. Um, I'm pretty sure that's like our favorite frozen pizza brand. So if you've not tried it, give it a try. We like the classic crust ones. We got some garlic, three cheese, um, garlic bread. We picked up some corn dogs for Winston. We got a pack of the three cheese, um, or the cheese tortellini. And then we picked up some of my favorite, the extra crispy fast food fries. Y'all, these are so delicious, especially in the air fryer. <laughs> They're really good. Picked up some Hot Pockets. I got the cheese and cheddar. And then Luke got the steak and chips. Steak and cheddar. These were two for four. Got Winston some chicken nuggets. We normally buy the Banquet brand ones and they were just completely sold out. So we picked up those. Got some Cool Whip and two deep dish frozen pie crust. I got some Rice Krispies. Got three um, little Lunchables. For Winston, there is the pizza one, there's a nacho one, and then there's a bologna and cracker one. Got some sour cream, a pack of pepperonis, some baby carrots, a gallon of milk. Got two things of tortillas. Got a loaf of bread. Got some eggs. I picked up two cans of green beans and two cans of peas. And then I also picked up some more of this um, Progresso tomato basil. Y'all, this is so good. This is, We had never had it um, before I had bought it because Taylor had recommended um, the Progresso brand. And so I think I bought two of them. The last time, and we've already went through them. They're really good, so I had to pick up some more. So I got two of those. Got some ranch. Got a four-pound bag of sugar. 
And we got some light brown sugar. Got a two pack of cream cheese. The cheese was not on sale this week, so I just picked up two of these bigger size bags. This is four cups, so I just got mozzarella and it's a Mexican style. That will get us through, and then hopefully next week the cheese is on sale. Kroger does pretty good on like kind of rotating their sale items, so I'm hoping that their cheese will go on sale again. Got some diced ham. Got two of those. I'll probably throw one in the freezer. Got some mesquite turkey breast for work to do some sandwiches. Uh, Luke picked up a single beer. Have you ever, you've had this, haven't you? Yeah. What is it? That's my favorite. Have one. Heineken's. Heineken. Heineken, yeah. So we got a beer. <laughs> I had been wanting to try these, so I threw these in um, the pumpkin spice cinnamon rolls. Luke picked up some hot chocolate with mini marshmallows. How much was it? Oh, I don't know. And then, of course, we had to um, get some Christmas cakes. So we got the Christmas tree cakes, and then we got the snowflake brownies. I really like these. We got those. Those were two for four dollars. I picked up two yogurts. I got the orange cream and the French vanilla. I really like these two and the Boston cream, but they didn't have the Boston cream at Kroger, so we just got those two. And then for the meat, they had their hamburger meat was what? What did I say? Five twenty. Yes. It was like five twenty four for one of these. Um, so we picked up four of them and then we just divide them in half. And then I'll pack, um, divide them in half and patty them out um, into freezer bags and then we'll throw them in the freezer. But we really needed some hamburger meat so I was so excited when they had it on sale. Uh, Luke picked up some ribs. He got two packs of ribs. This one was ten oh five. And then this one was 10.23. He also got two things of chorizo sausage. I got a pack of bacon. And then this is definitely a misprint, but we found it, so we picked it up. We got lucky. Um, but it said that this was um, 3.02 and it had to have been, all the other ones were like 15, um, like 13 to $15, even with this price. Um, it was only like a dollar or two off of each package, but they must have not changed, um, you know, their thing because we got this whole thing for 302, so I had to get them. So they must have figured it out after they marked that one and then changed their little scanner thing. <laughs> But that is everything on the table. Uh, of course, Luke got some L8. Y'all know that's a staple around here. And then we picked up some aluminum foil. I got three boxes of the freezer bags. We needed some, and then I needed some extra for the hamburger meat. We picked up these training treats for Max. And then I um, needed some girly items. And then I found this. I treated myself and got some of this um, tree hunt, tree hut. I can't talk. Um, this is the like the Epsom salt soak and then the body lotion. And it smells so freaking good. So I'll let y'all know what I think about this. But the. Um, Tropical mango, it smelled really good. So I treated myself and got those. But that is everything. Um, we'll try to come up with some sort of meal plan and I will write it down for y'all and share that next. Okay y'all, so here is the meal plan. As you can see, Winston helped me write it. He was very proud of himself. So I just had to keep it and share it. Um, 
So <laughs> instead of writing just a whole menu, I just let him write one word. Um, like I said, he was really proud of himself and I can kind of explain it as we go along. Um, so I did already, I did write tacos cause we have already had those. Um, and so y'all will see those in the next team dinner, just super easy. So this week Luke's having to go in early. And so that kind of cuts into me getting off work and having time to cook dinner. Um, so it's been a little, um, different and we're trying to do like quick meals. Um, and Luke's also helping cooking. Um, so we did tacos. We have um, frozen pizzas that we're going to pull out and pull, have one week. Um, Luke has already smoked some ribs. He smoked those Sunday because he was off work. Um, and they were absolutely delicious. Um, and then for the bacon, I'm going to do um, a bacon chicken pasta recipe. And then we got that mahi-mahi in there, so we're going to have that. Um, and I'll probably do like some rice and steamed veggies. And then uh, we really enjoyed that um, the tortellini bake that I had made a couple weeks back. And so I, will, I have everything to do it, so I'll probably do it again. But like I said, we're trying to keep it simple with him going to work early. Like pretty much by the time I get home, we have like... 30 minutes to maybe an hour before he leaves um and so we're trying to keep it really simple um but still not eat out so that is the game plan for this week i hope y'all enjoyed this video and i will see y'all in the next one bye y'all